So just to continue to document my progress tooling up the shop here, I added another vise. Uh, I don't know why, if I don't use it, I'll take it off. But uh, got more than one of me, one of us working here. So uh, I got to put some copper face plates in there. These ones work very best. Uh, add a little, little more grip where that uh, face of the vise might be a little sloppy. Um, like right here, uh, got this uh, little bending uh, apparatus built here and they're clamped in there as tight as they need to be. One of them's solid and the other one's moving around a little bit so I'll get some copper plates built for that. Um, I got a, there was a bolt hole here where you could fix something like this on here. But I find it doesn't work as well because I'm right-handed. This is my left hand, and I'm not as good uh, fixing the piece on there that I want to hold. And turning this with my right hand, I'm better off over on this side here. Jumping. Over on this side here, turn that with my left hand, and uh, hold my piece with my right hand. So, but whatever. I got that oiled up there this morning. Um, that good uh, good repair then uh, finally for the anvil and uh, the anvil stand I, I built these out of some scrap wood just to hold uh, some of the uh, hammers if they're handy when I want to use them drilled some holes in here for uh, things like uh, punches and uh, scribes and uh, the like Tacked on, uh, got a little bolster plate there for some smaller holes. Um, tack this on to hold uh, some different things like this hold down tool. Uh, got built. And I can give that a little schmuck and uh, use that to hold down some materials, the third hand. So, anyways, that should be everything for this this uh, go around